So anyways, we're back. Let's fish in again. Anyways, so yeah. How to catch long nice guards. So you go to your equipment, and I always use it on my bass because, well, okay, catch bass. I always fish this one. It takes a while to get to the area you want it. This. This is what I usually catch, and I catch big, big, uh, long nose guards on it. I don't know about these because I haven't bought them yet, but. This. This isn't the biggest, but it is still pretty big. It was 19 pounds, 44 inches. I think, I don't know. I've got the under. Well, they are it's pretty much just one eye, but different color. Anyways. You want to know where, um, where I caught that big long nose guard is? Yes, it is in the United States. Lakes, Lake Guttersville. I got it afternoon, selected my bass, and I choose the boat, and then go fishing. Anyways, so I did buy another fish head off camera because I finally leveled up and I got one. All right. So I'm just gonna be going in the same spot, except I'm not gonna be using the um the green pumpkins. That's one of my favorite YouTubers. I'm just gonna watch him after this, after I, after this live stream. I don't know if I'll, if I'll do it for long because then my, because my brother got mad at me and was trying to, because it shut off in the internet. That's because something's wrong with his room. And then you cast along these rocks with the leopard frog. Oh, I catch my fish is as I throw it out there. It ain't gonna go out far. We can get actually pretty close. I count to one second in my head. Then you can bring it around your boat, it's super, super hard, oh, there you go. I don't know, it's a coffee, but I guess I can catch them. To prove that this bait actually does work. See. Yes, you can catch stuff with this. It wasn't a long nose gar, but it still is something. I'm actually gonna move up a little bit closer. One reason why I like this game is that you don't have to get in your boat if you want to move a little bit up.
I do have the Bailey Destroyer Super Bad, I mean Super Bug. I don't use that unless it's like Boulder. But what I mainly catch fish on, it, like my catfish, the cast it out here. I'm gonna catch that catfish. I put it my attention on too. This is a natural color to fish, so they would like it, I would think. Yep. And it's a bass. Not a big one, so I won't lower my tension, but if I catch a big one. Like yesterday, I caught a 15.1. Ain't my, I mean, it's. It ain't my biggest bass, but it's my biggest largemouth, because I've got a 16 pound smallie, even though it doesn't register that I have it. But it's like, they're big, like the one I, like the largemouth I caught the other day, 15 pounds, one ounce. We've had some weird stuff happen to us with, uh, in the game. Sometimes we'll be fishing and we'll get a fish and then we'll look at it in the water. We're like, oh yeah, it's that pattern. And then after we catch it. Anyways, after we catch it, it's like a complete another pattern. Like I caught a large muff bass once and it turned into a small mass whenever I caught it. But you could see that it was a large mouse. It wasn't even the same pattern. It's bass. So if y'all know anyways how to catch like trout, because I want to go trout fishing in in here in this game. Just like part, just like leave a way how to trout fish. That's a beautiful smallmouth. That's a spotted. I need to get picture because I've never seen one like that. One problem with real life fishing is you have to go with good lures that won't break. Or you have to, I mean, you have to go with lures that won't break. Or you have to go with soft plastic lures. I mean, like, like this one I'm using. The Young Digger Green Pumpkin. If you want to catch fish, like bass. But you need its heads to catch catfish and carp. I actually finally caught one with that artificial blood worm. Not a catfish, but I actually caught something with it. I love how bluegill is like the most common fish to catch in like real life and I never catch one. I've never like caught one. I've always caught some fish, but it's never been a bluegill. 
Not that I know of. It's always been a little sunfish. Little trick for trying to get your lure back out there. Just raise it up and then roll it back in. See it's super in? Just go like. Boom. Text my mom. Anyways, yeah. Oh god, oh god, I have to set that without ruining my charger. Uh, you know what? I want to show something, but I can't. There is a there is a 60 pound catfish on one of the lakes, and I keep on getting bit by it. I'm not lying, I'm pretty sure it's the 60 pound catfish because it brings me out 169 yards. Not even 169, probably like, a, uh, like 175. No, it's not even that. I keep on forgetting about this point. But it brought me out 250. Then, a, and then it just stayed in the red and then it broke off. Anyways. So yeah, if you want to catch that, that 6 pound catfish, go for afternoon, use the fish heads. Uh, my mom sent me a message of a place in our town that is called Old Town Road. I want to go there and bring a horse. I don't know what I want. Uh, I guess. If you want to know the place I mainly fish. This is a good place to catch carp, but you also catch a lot of brim, and you also catch roaches. There's not a single catfish in here, I don't think. But I have not used the fish heads in here yet. I will maybe eventually do that, but I'm not willing to do that today. I'm just gonna go use the pool and I go for afternoon, and I use fish heads. So yeah, if y'all know how to... If y'all wanna know how to... Catch trout, please, please leave a suggestion because I want to go with carp fishing in this and maybe catch a lot of carp. Because I've only mean trout. I've caught a lot of. Because I've caught a lot of carp. And bass. I have not caught very much. <coughs> I have not caught very much. Uh, what is it? Trout. Anyways, go for the top. No. You go to this one. I already selected it. So. Go. Just in case y'all play this game, hold down R2. R2 can uh make you run faster. I always cast one right here. This is what my dad taught me. Cast another head out here. Then take the artificial blood worm. Because I thought it would do good. Just cast it out there. 
Wow! Then one problem with carp fishing or catfishing, if you're doing like this catfishing, you have to sit here and wait. Hey, hello, wherever. I'm just looking for. I'm just looking for a good place to go, like in. I did show that uh, spot earlier in the stream, if you want to see that, it is, I, I had nothing to do because I was just planning to do that, so I went fishing, bass fishing for a little bit, and I'm going cat fishing, because I want to catch that 60 pound catfish, anyways. See, this never happens whenever I live stream, but always whenever I'm done live streaming with this map on, it always has like a weird sound goes like, cool. and it sounds like an owl in the beginning, but then it like turns like, like, but then at the end it sounds like growling, like, oh, 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 and I can never figure it out. It might be an owl, but it, but it doesn't sound like an owl. I'm actually gonna move three because three ain't doing so good. It's over by the bank. I want it to be over by here. Yeah, I'd say that's about a good. Right, there we go. I don't know what I was doing. I have a fishing jersey in real life. I just don't know where it is. I mean, it doesn't have anything special. <gasps> Ooh, two people. Anyways, uh, yeah, that second person. Uh, I left it out earlier in the stream. I had it out earlier in the stream. Anyways, so out earlier in the stream, it's at Lake Bittersville. It's the top one. You go forward, then there's like rocks. Go to those rocks and then cast out the leopard frog. It's the middle one. Here's Optimus. I actually want to see what this means, so I'm actually going to watch it while live streaming, but I'm going to turn it down. Hello, third person. I'm just watching some Optimus right now. I caught a monster pipe. So it still wasn't a trophy. Aw, oh, crap. You were only one pound away from the trophy. You would have been the. You would have caught the first trophy. Not ever, but between both of us, you would have caught it. Well, first trophy monster pipe, yeah. Of all time. No, because Salt Lake's a 
trophy there is like a twinkle. Uh -huh. Like a big uh, boulder. You catch a spark, you catch a trouble pipe. You know, plus, I just thought trouble was. Oh yeah, that's what you have to catch like 50 pounders for. Hey, I cast it out out here. Should I move one? It's like right there. Should I move one? I don't want to move it. Just in between Alright. He's gonna be working a lot of overtime. Because he's gonna have two days off and maybe even three. In respect to this. I have to let it my dog go. Oh. Nice thing to catch me. I heard one while I was doing something. I don't like that movie. I don't like that horror movie anyways. Horror movies that are coming out. 
I haven't watched one. I only wanted to watch The Nun, and there was another one I wanted. Yes, Pet Cemetery. And I didn't get to see that because my mom watched it. When does this come out? When does it chapter two come out? When does this one come out? When does 47 meters down on cage come out? Man, there is no good ones that I want to watch. There's good stories to tell in the dark. I don't want to watch that one too very much. I'll see you later. Like, oh god. Four stories that are coming out this month. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see it in August. Rotate your device. No, oh, that's the trailer for it. You don't have to flip your device to watch that. Horror stories that are coming out in August. Forty-seven meters down on cake comes out the sixteenth of August. Hey dad, I got a catfish, got a whale's catfish. I'm just gonna have them get tired out. This isn't going to be like a 30 pounder. He can bring me out like 100 meters. guy wanted to go play a game pigeon with me and he did not even like play it. I I did my move and he never did his move.
Where I want to go next year is actually, uh, I actually want to go to ICAST 2020. Hopefully it's in, like, Dallas or something, because Dallas is only, like, a three-hour drive from Oklahoma. And that says if you don't get into any traffic. But depending on which time you go, there's going to be traffic. If you go in like the afternoon, yeah, there's probably going to be traffic. If you go late at night, then there's probably not going to be very much traffic because you don't really need to go to anything where you need to have jobs that you, that you would have to leave at 2 a.m. to go to. But hey, that's just me. I don't know. But yeah, so I really want to go to ICAST because they had some cool stuff there. These guys had like a freaking flounder there, like an imitation of a flounder, and it was super cool. Then these, then these other guys had like a simulation of like fighting a fish. And you could choose which fish you wanted it to be, so it's not like it was imported and then you just have to cast out the... No, you would know. It's like, which one you want to do? Tailfish. Alright, then you just have to reel in the tailfish. Then these other guys have like really cool realistic lures. Like one of them was like a little pike. And it was super cool. But then they also had this one that I liked. It was like a red lizard. And they can add to my collection because it's like a. Have y'all ever watched uh, First State Fishing? He made a video about using the weirdest lures. Those were those 3D snakes. Yeah, it looked like those, except it wasn't a snake, it was a red lizard. Lay down. So basically, Twitter or Facebook, if you post a meme on there, it, they can take, they can legally take it. And like, YouTube is one of the most useful websites, because if you're having trouble with something, it, it helps you, like... Oh yeah, I'm stuck on this part in the video game. Well, YouTube can help you. That's the big pike.
Yeah, what? I'm. Uh, don't. I don't. Hang on. I have to charge my headset. Anyways, as I was saying, if you need to use internet for a solo person game, that means just you and. You in the game, and it requires internet. That's stupid. I like this game because it's solo, but you can also go online. Hold on, I have to switch your phone. I just can't remember this one. There we go. You shouldn't be allowed, I mean, it shouldn't be, oh yeah, you have to connect to the internet, unless it, it unless it actually needs internet, like, there's a whole lot of, like, zombies or something, I don't know, I just said someone random, so, there's just a whole bunch of zombies, it, but, and it's too much to just have the game load by itself. I thought too. I was like that because it's actually a pretty good campaign and it doesn't require internet to play. Just for the campaign. Multiplayer. Oh, uh, yes. Okay, oh, one. I don't know which one that was. Anyways. If I buy a game, I want to play the game. I'm not going to sit there and read. Before I play the game. I, I want to play play the game. Like,
I can really only say sometimes it's gonna end this life in here. I'm going to end this one because here, that's a good one. Guards, you can see this one. I can't keep going on.